Even with the departure of key seniors off last year's 10 win and section runner up team, the Nevis Tigers haven't wasted any time picking up where they left off for this year with the fast start. Rewind to 2016 and a game away from state, the Nevis Tigers came just short of their goal falling to Wobbin. Now fast forward to this past Friday night and revenge was in full effect. Be the number one ranked Bombers on the road by 32 points. We knew that we really wanted to get it done because of uh, what they did last year. They took away our chance to go to the state tournament. And uh, we had a little chip on our shoulder from that. And we just really wanted to get out there and get it done. This year they're off to a 3-0 start, outscoring their opponents 104-24. to And it all starts with their senior class. When they get out on the field, they, you, know, the, you know, I don't have to do much. They make me look really good. And they do a lot of coaching. And, um, you know, it, it, we hang our hat on our seniors right now. One of those leaders is starting safety and quarterback Jack DeWolf that leads a balanced attack offensively. He's been throwing passes to me since fourth grade, like I said, and I love him. He's my buddy, he's family, and I'm just ready to make some noise. Jack calls all the plays and he runs everything, and I kind of coach up the other position guys, and um, it's like having another coach out there, having a guy that started three years for us. But don't let the two straight 40-point games fool you. The Tigers' bread and butter is on the other side of the ball. Defense is first in our mind. Coach DeWolf does an amazing job, and um, every week you know, our goal is to shut out the other guys. We take great pride in our defense, and defense gives us short fields, and that allows us to score some points. So even though the end goal is getting to state, Nevis goes by two simple words, earn it. We have to earn every single game, week in and week out, and prove that we're, we're a good football team. We've had a lot of successful years, and. We just want to kind of go out with a bang and finish this last one out the way we want it to. They're back at home Friday night hosting Northern Freeze. We'll have those highlights Friday night at 10. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.